Hanlon's Razor, a mental model for thinking rationally about the actions of others. In philosophy, a razor is a principle that lets the thinker eliminate or shave away unlikely explanations or reduce unnecessary actions. So what is Hanlon's Razor? Hanlon's Razor is stated as, never attribute to malice that which is adequately explained by carelessness. It has also been quoted as, never attribute to malice that which is adequately explained by stupidity, or neglect, or even incompetence. Hanlon's razor has existed in similar forms for at least a few centuries. However, as it is named, it is probably attributed to Robert J. Hanlon of Scranton, Pennsylvania, as a submission to a book of jokes related to Murphy's Law that was published in 1980. The principle itself has even been around at least since the time of Napoleon Bonaparte, who famously declared, never ascribe to malice that which is adequately explained by incompetence. Regardless of whoever first said it, it can be a very useful mental model for rationally considering a situation that may at first glance appear to be intentionally harmful or even malicious. Hanlon's razor is very similar to another famous razor, Occam's razor. Occam's razor basically says that typically the simplest solution or the one with the fewest variables and assumptions is usually the best choice. Often the simplest solution to a question about malicious intent is that the offender most likely did not intend harm and was just acting carelessly. You can probably think of some moments in your life when either you did stop yourself from getting angry and instead chose to give the other person the benefit of the doubt, or perhaps you made the mistake of getting angry at someone because you thought they had malicious intent behind their actions when in fact they were just careless or incompetent. Knowing about Hanlon's razor can make you consciously aware of these types of situations in the future hopefully before you automatically react. Situations where Hanlon's razor is highly relevant could be when viewing media reports where the reporter may be trying to sensationalize a situation to generate outrage from viewers when in fact the situation was merely the result of a series of careless actions on the part of the offender. Another area where Hanlon's razor is valuable is in relationships and communication in general. It is very common for people to assume that someone they know did something on purpose, which then fosters a feeling of resentment. In many cases, the offending person may have just been careless or incompetent. The best course of action is often to assume that they, in fact, did not act maliciously. While it is probably true that most often the best explanation is to follow Hanlon's razor and to not attribute to malice what is adequately explained by carelessness, every once in a while, though, there may be genuine malicious intent. But by working our way through the thought process of Hanlon's razor, we can help guarantee that we do not arrive at that conclusion prematurely. Now let's review the important points of what we've covered. Hanlon's razor is a mental model useful for thinking rationally about the behavior of others. Hanlon's razor says, never attribute to malice that which is adequately explained by carelessness. Hanlon's razor can help keep us from jumping to inaccurate conclusions about the intent of others' behavior and can be quite useful when dealing with news stories, social media posts, social situations, and relationships in general. Basically, it helps us to make less unnecessary enemies. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for great future content. And if you think this video can help someone else, please share it with them.